Hey, welcome to the channel today. Um, okay, so a couple of things, couple of things we got to go over. Um, first off, <laughs> thank you so much. So we almost got 5,000 subscribers on the channel, which is insane to me. That's excellent. You guys are liking the videos. That's great. Um, so tomorrow, I think we're going to do a subscriber special, 5,000 subscribers special. Um, um, and we're gonna do a giveaway. So I think I'm gonna give away something um, that I've built um, on one of the other videos. So make sure and tune in, make sure your notifications are on. Um, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do the giveaway yet, but I'm gonna do a giveaway. So tune in tomorrow for the episode, of course. Okay, so we got that out of the way. Now, <laughs> just super excited. Thank you guys so much for subscribing and for all your comments. And then of course for, you know, all your input too. It kind of helps me out, kind of lets me know where I'm at. Um, as far as gameplay, your input is way more valuable for sure because you guys are always a ton better at playing than me, but I'm getting better, I'm getting better. So watch, you're gonna watch this. I know you guys don't like replays, but I'm gonna show you this replay and we're gonna show you this golem deck today, but this replay is absolutely insane. I know you guys don't like a ton of replays, so I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it limited to the one, only because this replay kind of like, dude, it helped me out kind of a lot, and it's, and it's so it's so close. I can't tell you whether I win or lose. Crap, you already saw that I won, but I can't. You don't know that I won. Maybe I'll edit that out. Okay, so right here, right at the start, look at that. So he dropped Miner, and then I should have dropped Skeletons, but I dropped Minions. So that was a learning moment. And then right here again, you see the Golem it took six hours to spawn. So anyway, so there's some learning moments right at the start there that I learned about the golem and then also should have taken out the miner with the skeletons. I use a lightning there um, and it actually worked for me but I'm way behind on elixir. And so, oh and then right here too. So he's got mega minion. I should have dropped mega minion for his mega minion but I didn't. I screwed up and I dropped baby dragon. Baby dragon does tons less damage. And so luckily I had skeletons to take out his bomber after the bomber focused on the tower, but he took my tower down so far. But anyway, so just um, a note here, as far as playing and stuff, I've been really focusing on trying to not, uh, one, trying not to over defend, and then two, trying not to um, use more elixir than my opponent's using. And so since I've been doing that, I've been, I've been noticing that my battles are more streamlined, and I've been doing a little bit better, which is is good. And so it's it's actually it's helping me a lot. And so it's helping me uh, kind of I think uh, be more strategic with the way I play and less sporadic. And so if you guys do that, try to uh, count your elixir. Try to not count necessarily because I think that's boring. <laughs> it's a game for heaven's sakes. But try to um, make sure you're not using so so for example on that minor play. When he dropped the Miner, if I would have dropped Skeletons, it would have probably taken him out almost as fast as the Minions took him out, but I would have been two Elixir ahead instead of an even Elixir trade. So that would have been way better. So right here, I probably over defended again, and you know, I I don't know that I need, ah, I probably needed to because he would have took the tower on that push. And the Mega Minion comes in here and does pretty good. Um, right here, I dropped the Golem. Yep, so I dropped the Golem. And then I'm going for that because I got to take that tower. The Mega Minion, see the Mega Minion actually got two shots off. And so I dropped Baby Dragon, hopefully to take that Bomber out uh, quick enough so the Bomber doesn't do anything to the tower. Unfortunately, it gets one hit off. And then the Giant's going to town on my tower with that Rage spell and everything. But, but what you didn't notice is over there, my Golem ended up getting to the tower and took it out. So it worked out great. It just worked out great. So anyway, so we're going over here pretty... He's ahead of me in damage right now. And then he's got... His little bomber just annoying as all get out. He drops a giant in the back, and I'm sitting full of elixir, so as soon as he drops his giant, I drop my golem on the same lane, and I'm gonna make a push for it. He's sitting full of elixir now, too. I noticed he was sitting at full elixir for quite a while there, so that may have hurt him a little bit here in the end. So he's got his elite barbs, which are an excellent counter to the golem, of course. He drops his rage spell, unfortunately, so I go ahead and lightning his elite barbs, thanks to a tip from a comment in one of my videos. And it does great. And so with the log and everything else, take everything else, get a little bit of damage on the tower. And then I'm left over there on the tower. I have 944 and he's down to 608. He drops Golem, right? Or his giant right here. This is where the clutch plays come in. So I drop Furnace. And then I freaking drop a baby dragon right there. And I'm thinking, oh, dude, I did not need to do that because the giant would have went to the king tower and done nothing anyway. So I'm thinking, oh, shoot. The baby dragon is basically headed off to nowhere land over on the king tower, and I'm gonna be pooched. But you see that? Baby dragon cuts it back. 
<laughs> cuts back over. You see how close that battle was at the end? He was raged up, dude. That was intense at the end there, dude. I thought that was the sweetest battle ever. So, um, anyway, so we're going to try and we're going to get into a battle here using that same golem deck um, and see if we can't do uh, kind of replicate it or do the best we can to replicate it. Um, see if we can't get some good pushes going on here. So we're going to get in here with, it looks like Big Vic, all right? So Big Vic's coming our way. And he's got the hammer in his shield, so, but he's probably not, a, he's not a champion, or what is it, the hammer champion? Yeah, anyway, so, I've been patient too on my beginnings, I've been waiting for people to start out, ooh, crap, see, Lava Hound, oh my gosh, this is probably, mm, I haven't faced really, with this deck, I haven't faced a Lava Hound yet, and I probably should have, oh, come on, get his Mega Minion, dang it, we're gonna have to use minions to hopefully take out his Mega Minion, Please just take him out. Just take him out. There we go. So that worked out really well. And then we're going to use Furnace to distract the balloon. That'll distract the balloon for about three seconds. Oh, come on. Take that balloon out. Oh, that worked out so well. And then our golem is pretty much not going to do anything this push. He's pretty much gone, so I'm not going to support him with anything. I'm just going to wait until he drops his Lava Hound again. And then when he drops the Lava Hound, man, I don't know... We really didn't defend that well against it. But, drop Valkyrie, that worked out really well for us because we'll drop that and, oh crap, oh crap. I freaking missed it, <laughs> I knew it. We'll take Skeletons, we'll take out that e Wiz. No, we won't. Hey, at least our baby dragon's doing a ton of work over there. That e Wiz is gonna do a ton of damage to our tower. Gosh dang it, that was brutal. So now we gotta get ready for another push here. Um, I'm gonna drop Let's see, what should I do? What should I do? So I'm gonna drop Golem in the back, and hopefully he drops Lava Hound too, so as to not punish me as badly as I should be punished for dropping Golem right now. Um, Big Vic, come on, what you gonna do? Nothing? Maybe Big Vic left for a little bit. Maybe he got bored with our gameplay and left. <laughs> it, it seems to me like he's gone. I don't know, what do you guys think? I think he's gone. So we're just gonna finish out this battle, I guess, real quick. I think Big Vic had us. He he might have had us because the Lava Hound was doing pretty dang good. Um, so it's unfortunate. He would have done really good. So we're going to go Lightning. Just take that tower out real quick and we'll get right into another battle. Sorry, Big Vic. Uh, I don't know if uh, maybe you dropped your phone on the ground. And, oh, dude, it happens to me all the time. But how come it doesn't say opponent left the match anymore? It never says that, really. Maybe he watched me win. That was nice of him. Anyway, we'll get right into another battle here. Hopefully we can get a better battle for us here. Okay, so, um, right into it. Perfect. Um, I'm just gonna wait for him. I'm just gonna wait, I'm just gonna wait. Oh crap, oh crap. I really don't have a lot for that. Hopefully we'll take out that Ice Spirit. Yeah, that worked out really well. So he used, so four Elixir, we used four Elixir plus two. So he's ahead on Elixir, but we got a Baby Dragon coming in hot. Coming in hot on the tower. That's what I'm talking about. We'll use Furnace, hopefully we can, ah, dang it, stinking, there you go, there you go, Furnace, there you go, that's good, that's good, I like that, I like that, that worked out really well. Okay, Furnace took out his minion horde, we got minions coming in hot, unfortunately we have, oh, but he's a, he's a level 10, so our fire spirits, oh, that was a dumb play, he should not have played his hog right there, right, right, or should he have? I guess that worked out for him. I'm just sitting here, dude. I'm just sitting here talking. Okay, so we're gonna put a golem down. We're gonna just go hard. We just, oh, niz niz. We're pretty much screwed. We're screwed. We just lost that tower completely, like all the way. It's like, it's gone. Like, it's gone. Like, I don't even need it anymore. I don't even want it. Um, so what has he got? He's got, hopefully not Inferno Tower. That's, okay, we're gonna log that and then we're gonna put Mega Minion. And then hopefully we'll get the golem all the way to the tower. We can do a ton of... Dang it! Quit it! That is so annoying. Okay, come on, minions. Take out his minions. Nope. He didn't take out... How come it didn't kill his minion at all when it blew up? Dude, it didn't even hurt his minion. It didn't even hurt his minion again. What the flip? <laughs> okay, that's getting annoying. <laughs> we'll soak up that ice spirit, I guess, with our skelly. <laughs> Shoot. 
<laughs> okay, so now we gotta get another golem push coming our way. So as soon as he drops his elite barbs, I'm just gonna lightning the crap out of him. I really don't have a ton of defense. I'm gonna have to put a golem down on defense for his elite barbs if he drops them. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. Put a golem down. Hopefully they'll whack away at him for a little bit and then get bored and then they'll run off into their own land and then we'll be okay. So I'm gonna put that down and then that should take care of all those little skeletons and then hopefully he drops his little minion horde. Yep, there's a minion horde. <laughs> what am I gonna do, lightning it? <laughs> Gosh dang it. Oh crap. Okay, don't fireball us. Okay, we gotta get a golem in there real hot. We gotta get a golem in there fast. Okay, so golem, come on. We should be able to get that cleaned up, and then hopefully we'll have to log his skeleton. Ah, oh, shoot. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on. Do that, do that. And then pop, and then take that out. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is so close. I, I really don't know what else I can do. I don't know what else I can do there. Oh, that was so close. That was so close, dang it. Okay. That was unfortunate to finish on that one. Um, anyway, be sure and tune in tomorrow. We're going to do a subscriber special, just like I said. 5,000 subscribers. Excellent. Thank you guys so much. Um, looking forward to 10, 25, 50, even more. We'll do more giveaways and stuff like that. Um, thanks for dropping by the channel today. Leave some comments below, some likes, and good luck.